Hey y'all, it's Stacy. So, oh my gosh, I feel like it has been forever since I have filmed a daily vlog. And I thought, ooh, there's Miss Foxy. Say hello, Miss Foxy. Fox. Fox. She's not having it. <laughs> but anyways, yeah, so I thought I would film a daily vlog today. Let me turn this thing around. I don't like when the, um, what is this thing called? The display screen. I don't like it when that is facing me because I feel really weird. Like, just looking at myself, but then, like, talking to y'all. I don't know. But anyways, yeah, so right now, I'm actually just, let's see here, sitting at my computer, and I'm checking my Facebook page, um, and then I was also checking my Life with Stacey D page, and I just posted that I think I'm going to do another Get Ready With Me video today. They are so fun. Oh, look, Miss Lindsay says thumbs up. So yeah, y'all give them a thumbs up if y'all um, if y'all like watching those videos because I, I mean, I just really enjoy doing them. I mean, like I said, like I always say in all my videos, I'm not a beauty vlogger, I'm not a beauty expert, but you know, I'm a girl and I do my makeup and I have lots of different makeup. So it's just, it's fun to film those and then edit them, speed them up, add music, do funny, you know, little waves. You know, it's just, I don't know, it's fun. So I think I'm gonna do one of those. Um, and then another thing, oh, let me show y'all something. So, as y'all know, Valentine's Day was, I think it was last Tuesday? I don't know, something like that. What, what is today, Monday? Yeah, it was last Thursday. So, here are my roses that Joseph got me. They are actually starting to die, but oh my gosh, they were gorgeous. is the um a little puppy that came in a valentine's mug he gave me and these are salt and pepper shakers that came from cracker barrel i actually collect these every um every like season or holiday every little holiday they have a different set so he got me those he got me a happy valentine's day balloon oh and foxy's birthday was um an our five years since meeting anniversary, um, it was last Friday, the day after Valentine's Day. Sorry, she's working at Joseph. Um, but anyways, our five, so it was Valentine's Day last Thursday, and Friday was five years since we, we met, and then Saturday was Foxy's birthday, so she turned, how old did you turn, baby? No, yeah, 28, no, four, she turned four, so that would be four times seven, what is that? And to think I was in advanced math all through high school and I didn't even know what seven times four is. Babe, what's seven times four? 28. Okay, so she, I can't believe I forgot. 7, 14, 21, 28. Okay, so she turned 28. Ah! Foxy, you're one year younger than mommy. Yeah, I will be. Go with us to the strip club. Oh my gosh. Okay. So anyway, for her birthday, let me show y'all what she got. She got a new toy chest um, that says fetch because she has, yeah, because I had lots of toys, mama. Um, she got this new blanket um, that's got paw prints on it. It's actually a pet fleece blanket. So I like to keep that over this chair. Because when she sits on it or, you know, the cat sit on it, it doesn't. Like, you can wash this instead of it getting all over your furniture. Um, so, those were her two big gifts. Well, those were her two only gifts, really. And the reason I got her another toy chest, <laughs> she ran in here, she thought I was playing, is because she already had this one. But, as you can see, she has a lot of toys. And her, um... Her toys fill up both of the boxes when they're put up. So it's just easier to have a box in here and then a box in the bedroom because that's where she plays with them at. Ain't that right, hon? Say, yeah. Um, and then, what else did Mr. Joseph get me? He got, I mean, he was so sweet. He, first he comes and he rings the doorbell on Valentine's Day. And I go to the door and he had a dozen hot pink roses and y'all know, I'm obsessed with some Dunkin' Donuts sweet tea. And he had a sweet tea. 
And then <laughs> I was like, oh, this is so sweet. I mean, that was enough for me. Roses and a tea, heck yeah. So then he comes through the garage door and he's got, let's see, this was his bag, the one I gave him with goodies. Now he had a bag like kind of similar to that. And he came through this door and he had the balloon in his hand. And in the bag was this love cup, which had the puppy, the stuffed puppy I just showed y'all. And um, a box of uh, Whitman's chocolate and a cookies and cream candy bar. Uh, two salt and pepper, the salt and pepper shakers. Um, let's see, he didn't give me too much candy because y'all know I don't. You know, it's not good for me to eat a lot of candy. Um, he got me this Ghirardelli limited edition Valentine's Chocolate Duo. Uh, let me just say that this stuff is ridiculously amazing. I have not tried this yet, the chocolate and strawberry. As y'all know, I'm not real big on chocolate chocolate, um, but white chocolate, this was amazing. So I'm gonna try this though. But yeah, he got me that. And my goodness, I mean, that's, that's like more than enough. And then he got me um, a couple other like little candy things. So it was real. Oh, and then he got me um, a card from him and then a card from the babies. And then I got him three cards, one from me, um, one from Foxy, and one from Phoenix and Max. Um, those of you with pets probably know this, but if you go to like the card section, they actually have cards now like from your dog, from your cat. So yeah, check that out. Um, and then these are the Valentine's cupcakes that I baked him. See, it's got a little cupid and a little heart, and then I just decorated them. Um, and these are the ones that are left, so that's why they're in the cake platter. Um, and then I gave him a ton of Reese's candy. And then, um, let's see, this Skittle. For Valentine's Day, we mostly, oh, and Joseph brought me a, um, my favorite donut from like a donuts too but um for valentine's day we mostly do candy and um flowers that's just what we do so yeah um anyway so it is 10 52 and i am going to i'm actually about to go to my mom's house and clean today's her cleaning day and foxy is gonna sit there and stare at me because she's super cute and I don't know. I think I'm going to go by there for donuts and get a sweet tea. Um, yeah. Oh, as for my weight loss, it's going fabulous. I'm still in the 150s. Um, I actually think I weighed like 158 this morning. Something like that. Yeah. So that's really great. And I actually think I'm going to set another goal for after when I hit 145, which I'm only like 10 to 12, 10 to 11 pounds away from that. But I'll do a separate video on that because I know some people that watch our daily vlogs aren't, you know, interested in um, like weight loss. So we shall see. Oh, look. Hang on now. I need to mark that off and that off. So I'm right there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Okay, so yeah, I'm 12 pounds away from goal and then this is a little thingy my bobber i got from target okay so i think i've done enough talking now and i'll see y'all later hey y'all okay so i just got to my parents house and i made a little stop sorry i'm always <laughs> really out of breath when i come up their stairs because there's a lot of stairs but anyways <sighs> but i made a little stop by donkey donuts and i got me a sweet tea because they are ridiculously delicious. I haven't had one in since Valentine's Day, so yeah. And then I got me a powder, powdered sugar vanilla cream filled donut. So yeah, I'm going to have that. I haven't even eaten today. Ugh, crazy Stacy. Oh, my mom put out some little decorations for um, Easter. Oh my gosh, those are so, what are those little sheep? She is so cute. I wonder where she got those. And then she has little egg trees. And then, oh my gosh, what is this? That's so cute. It's a cat picture frame with spot, a spot for four cats. That's really cute. Um, she left me a, some presents, she said. Look at her little bunny and her little egg basket. Hey, Toto. Hi. What are you doing, baby? You're such a good girl. 
And there's Miss Precious. Hey, girl. You want to run away? Okay. Let's see. I don't, she said she left me a box. Oh, and she said she got me a couple of Valentine's Day bags for next year. Let's see. She said they're in the top drawer, but they're not in there. Let's see. Maybe, oh, they're in here. Okay. Oh, how cute. She gave me tissue paper and bags. Oh, my gosh. How cute are those for next year? Um, what she did is she went uh, the day after Valentine's Day. and Or she went shopping yesterday. I don't know. But she said those were on sale for like a dollar. And they originally probably like three dollars. So she said I could take three. Well, she said I could have all of them. But I told her I'd at least leave her. She said just leave me one. I said, ah. Mom, I don't need all those. She said, well, take them. I said, okay. So, let's see. So, she said, I just need one for you and Joseph. I said, okay. And then she said, oh, look at the little um, tissue paper she got me. Okay. So, that was so sweet. She, my mother is seriously, like, too good to me and my sister and my husband. I say my husband. Joseph. Y'all know my husband's name. So, yeah. And then, oh, my gosh, y'all. She got Foxy a Easter dress. <laughs> hang on. Listen, I haven't seen it yet. I have not seen it yet. So, hang on. Let's look in here. Oh, my gosh, y'all, look. She got me some Easter um, towels, dish towels to hang on my stove. Oh, my gosh, that's so cute. Oh, and then that one's just striped. Let's see. Oh, it's three of them. Let's see. Cotton tail lame set of three kitchen towels. So there's the egg one, the striped one. Oh, and then a yellow stripe. That is so, so I can hang two of these on my stove and then put one out. Oh, that's so cute. She is so thoughtful. Like, I love her. Oh, my gosh. Y'all. <gasps> Shut up. Okay, I've officially died. I've officially died. Y'all, really? Really? Oh my gosh. This is for Foxy. <laughs> Let's see how much this was. $9.99. Medium, which is what she wears. Oh my god, $9.99. That's kind of expensive. Oh my god, I'm gonna die, y'all. Okay, and it's got a little toot. It's got, um tool underneath it okay yeah i'm sorry i know i'm ridiculous but i'm having a fit over that and then that's just a plate that um i had baked cupcakes um for them for valentine's day and brought them and then i don't know what's in here let's see okay, now this is an angel that my aunt got me oh look at her little pigtails she got one, okay, this is a fun, this is a crazy story. She got this for my sister when we were, like, really little. My sister's 34 now. Yeah. And my sister's had this for, like, you know, 30 years. And they were in a thrift store. My mom and her were in a thrift store. And she just happened to find this exact same angel. So, she got it for me. Isn't that crazy? So, yeah, I got to call my aunt. And that's my aunt that actually just found out that she has cancer. Um, she has breast cancer, so if y'all could really keep her in your prayers, we would so much appreciate that, because this is the same aunt that if y'all been with me for a while, uh, to make a long story short, uh, a couple years ago, she got double pneumonia. She was in the hospital for like three months. She was on a ventilator for so long that it destroyed her lungs, so now she's on oxygen. She's young, too. She's like 50 something um now she's on oxygen like all the time she has to carry around an oxygen tank um and her lungs fill up with fluid so we had a real bad scare last week they didn't think like from what i understood they didn't think she was i don't know they didn't think she was going to get better i took it as they didn't think she was going to make it and i was really upset but they meant there's nothing more that they can do for her medically. Um, and the doctor said she's just going to be in and out of the hospital for the rest of her life because her lungs are going to continue to just fill up with fluid. And they'll have to, you know, 
and then she basically kind of it drowned you know it drowns her so she has to go to the hospital you know and um and then they have to drain her lungs so yeah and then last week last friday she found out she's got breast cancer she can't have a double mastectomy because she can't be put under because she's not strong enough she can't go through chemo or radiation um just because of other you know medical problems so yeah um the power of prayer is very strong um so if y'all could just please keep her in your prayers i love her dearly and um yeah so i'm going to get started on cleaning now and I'm <laughs> <laughs> okay show your haircut okay oh okay now do a little turn <laughs> looks beautiful Hey y'all! Okay, so I uh, just sorry, looking for the mute button on my television. Um, oh, do not mind that's it. Oh, but up, I don't know if um, y'all watched my um, weigh-in video a couple days ago, but um, I was showing y'all how I had like an acne breakout, which I never have and i've never had acne or anything like that but um i had it all along my chin i mean so you can see right there where it was right there that's kind of like one that's been there she's not gone away yet but anyways um look it cleared itself up which is great um that's just uh like a not a scar but where it's still healing but there's nothing there and then that's where it's healing and that was the zit the straight up zit um that's where that's healing and that's just a little zit so that's an update for those who were um you know commenting and giving me suggestions for my um like breakout and stuff i really appreciate it and what i ended up doing is i took um i think it was one person suggested um don't do anything leave it alone or maybe a couple people which is what i normally do i don't normally um start um you know putting things on it and um mass and things like that but i did this time because i i was like what the crap it's not going away so anyways uh some of y'all told me to leave it alone and i did and after i think it was like two days it's kind of dried up so thank you so much for y'all's advice and yeah i just got home from cleaning moms and as you can tell my makeup is like on <laughs> and i am exhausted that was like the best workout cleaning house is a great workout y'all um I was there from 10 till almost 3 so that's five hours so yeah and I didn't take a break I just cleaned the whole time so yeah now I'm home and there is Missy Pris and I'm going to fold some laundry um oh I'm gonna edit this vlog and I'm gonna um check the mail and Joseph brought me some Chinese um food oh here it is sesame chicken and egg roll yeah totally bad stacy for reals um but yeah i'm gonna eat some of that and then i've got a whole nother basket of laundry i need to fold and then i need to wash joseph's clothes actually i'm gonna do that right now let's see if there's anything in there there's not so yeah um i'm gonna go ahead and end our vlog to uh the, today right now because i don't know what i'm gonna be doing tonight just kind of I know I'm going to work out uh, for at least 30 minutes, both strength training, um, the elliptical, and uh, cardio. So I know I'm going to be doing that. And then probably uh, I want to watch Catfish from last night, the season finale. And then I want to watch The Biggest Loser from last night. So yeah, that is what I will be doing. And I hope you have a great night. And y'all comment below. And I'll talk to y'all soon. Bye!